Hey, my name is Bhavani Kola. Welcome back to another session of Face to Face to Online Transition. In today's session, we will be looking at how can you use the Canon camera as your webcam. This is the best thing I have done so far. Your picture is much more clear and you teach and present like a pro. So without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. In order to use your Canon camera as a webcam, you need to go ahead and download the EOS webcam utility. I will go ahead and paste the link in the description box below you simply click on the link you land right here go ahead and choose your operating system I'm a Windows user so I'm gonna go ahead and click on Windows scroll all the way down as you can see this utility webcam is actually compatible with all these applications here your teams zoom YouTube live even OBS as you scroll further down, you will have to go ahead and select your model first. Go ahead and see which is your camera. In my case, I have a T6 Rebel T6i. Rebel T6i, that's what it's called. I'm going to go ahead and click on that. And as you can see, this is where I landed up. You will go ahead and click on Drivers and Download. And keep in mind, you're only downloading the EOS utility for Windows. Go ahead and select that. Click on the download button. I have downloaded that already. So I'm going to go ahead and take you to my download folder. So here I am in my download folder. I have the EOS webcam utility as a zip file. Go ahead and extract it. And simply click on the exe file dot exe file to go ahead and set it up on your PC. And once you click on your exe file, it's going to ask you to set it up. You will go ahead and click next, 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 and finish the installation process. I have done this already, so I'm not going to redo it, but I'm going to go ahead and show you how you can use this in your meetings, your live lectures. There is a day and night difference between these two cameras. And I highly recommend to restart your computer once the installation is complete. So now let's go ahead and take a look at the difference between the cameras. So here I am on my camera app and this is the view from my laptop. Now let's go ahead and change it to my EOS camera and take a look on how different it is. And this is the view from my EOS. As you can see, it's much more brighter, clean and crisp. I am using 50mm lens with 1.8 aperture. That's why you can see it's much more clear and the background is a little bit blurry as well. Now let's go ahead and take a look on how it looks on Microsoft Team and Zoom. So here I am in my Microsoft Teams. I'm going to go ahead and initiate a meeting. And I'm going to go ahead and show you how it looks with the regular webcam. As you can see, this is my regular webcam view. Same lighting, nothing changed. Now let's go ahead and see the EOS. As you can see, this is my EOS view, much more clean, crisp. You actually feel like a pro when you're presenting it. So let's go ahead and take a look in the Zoom interface. I'm simply going to click on Settings, Video. As you can see, this is the webcam from my laptop. It's the same lighting. I'm not going to change anything. All I'm going to do is change it to my EOS. As you can see, there is a day and night difference between both the cameras. It's much more clean and crisp, and you feel like a pro when you're presenting using this camera. I was actually looking for various webcams while I had this Canon right under my bed. Why waste money when all I had to do was download the EOS utility software? I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you learned something new today. If you did, please make sure you like and subscribe. And if you think it's worth sharing, please go ahead and do so. There could be an educator who might really like this pro feature and wants to make sure the students can see him or her much more clearly. And always remember, happy teaching and please take care of yourself.